Aloha, intuitive healer, author, warrior for your wellness, Trisha Gumberg here talking about November's energy. Um, I'm in a slightly different spot, uh, but I still have that uh, fabulous background uh, to support us in relaxing, reminding us to take our body and mode of the belly breaths. Uh, we come together each week because I know the more often that we say yes to who we are, the more magic that we will create. Talking about the master number 22 because the 11 of November added to the 11 that is 2018 creates a 22 the, about being a master builder and as I had talked about last week about co-creating. You are the master builder in your own life. And today we're going to simplify that number uh, by looking at it as the number four. Uh, a lot of numerologists aren't willing to do this, but I think it's a good idea to simplify it. Uh, looking at the attributes of the number four, if you have my book, say yes, it is on page uh, 14 and 15. <clears throat> I, today, I'm going to uh, use uh, my numerology cards that go with that book so that we can see the words. And I'll list them. <clears throat> so we have loyal, loyalty, being loyal as an attribute of the number four. Being logical. Uh, building, this is a good word. Remember, we're, we're doing it step by step. And uh, we, did, we can think about the end, but mostly it's, you know, we think about the foundation uh, most of all. Aha, yes, foundations. Uh, that's the next word. Solid. You have to make sure that those foundations are solid. Uh, following uh, solid leads as well. That's, I just heard that, solid using a step-by-step -step process. Reliability, being reliable, and being thoughtful, full of thought. Okay, let's take a few minutes now of quiet and see if, if any of those words that I listed, any of those attributes of the number four uh, resonate with you. Uh, I'm going to tune in to my own cards and see if I can get a hit, an intuitive hit on one of these cards. So let's just Okay, um, I'm getting a hit on the word logical, um, uh, but I'm, I'm hearing don't let that trip you up. Oh, uh, let's see, how, how am I, how, it doesn't all have to be logical, some of it's going to be logical, and don't let the logic of it trip you up. Um, and I think that this word is very sub is the word subjective. That what is logical to some somebody is not logical to everyone, right? It's only logical. Reminds me of Big Bang Theory. It's only logical. Um, what's logical for you? What makes sense? for you, right? Not everybody can uh, do video, live video from the beach. Um, that wouldn't be logical for you to put that maybe on your next step if you lived in Wisconsin. Uh, but for me, it's very logical and almost silly uh, that I don't use that as my backdrop. Okay, 
So we now have the attributes of the number four uh, to support us in being master builders in our lives. So I'm going to um, end this video just by stepping out of the way. If you want to take a few more bottom of the belly breaths with me as we tune into those waves. Thank you for tuning in to me. Um, as I was trying to be quiet just now, uh, the logical, it reminded me of the Big Bang Theory that it was uh, when uh, Sheldon wrote, this, wrote a script. That he wanted uh, Penny to teach him how to be a better teacher and she was going to give him some acting uh, classes and she was reading his script. It's only logical. And so then I got, um, it is absolutely not logical for a lot of people when you talk about intuitive abilities. And I thought about that because my ears were, um, I was getting my signal as I was looking out into the ocean. And for a lot of people, intuitive abilities, or the fact that I can uh, take a deck of cards and one of them uh, will resonate with me and I will feel and I will know that that is the card and that that's so not logical like how do you even explain that that's not logical but it's totally logical for me it makes perfect sense that I can pick up some cards and one and they're going to talk to me they're going to give me information for other people whoo that's just being a lunatic right so um, <laughs> what's logical for you what's the next step for you okay thank you for tuning in know that I love you and aloha